guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, then hi, I'm Tabishi, your girl next door. talk about a skincare habit routine upgrade whatever you may want to say it that i wanted to try for a long time and i finally did and i have done my little bit of research on that and i wanted to come here and talk about that and the process that i'm talking about is chemical exfoliation in this video i'm going to tell everything about chemical exfoliation the one that i tried what did i what were the issues that I found, um, was I hesitant to try it and you know the do's and don'ts of chemical exfoliation. So if you want to know what I'm talking about and if you want to know my experience on chemical exfoliation then please stay tuned with me. Okay so I will give you a brief of what chemical exfoliation is and what I tried and everything but before that I want to let you know which product I'm talking about. The product that I'm talking about is from the brand called Amino and the uh, chemical exfoliation that I tried was AHA peel and I will give you the details of everything this is how the product looks like and I will give you every single detail about the packaging the texture and everything but first I want to let you know what exactly chemical exfoliation is so that you get familiar with the term which I'm going to be using throughout the video okay so chemical exfoliation is like a step up in your skincare of course but how we do physical exfoliation right I think if you are someone who follows skincare you might be knowing what I'm talking about so there are two categories of exfoliation one is physical exfoliation which is the normal scrub that we use and one is chemical exfoliation now chemical exfoliation is not really new in the market but it's something really new that I have tried I wanted to try this for a long time but I was very skeptical um, why? Because chemical exfoliation is stronger. It's more effective, but it's stronger. You are going to be using chemicals on your skin to help to improve your skin texture. But if you are going to be using chemicals on your skin, of course, there are a lot of things that you have to take care of. There are a lot of chemical peels available in the market from different, different brands. The one that I chose is from the brand called Amino and this is their AHA Power Peel. So first, let's talk about the packaging of this product. Now that I've told you what really chemical exfoliation is, right? So, um... This comes in a white cardboard like this and the package, like the box is really sturdy, very high quality box. This is, this makes, like gives me a feel of international packaging and the inside this you get this jar and this is like a glass jar as you can see this is translucent in nature now i will leave the details of everything related to this product in the description box below so you can go ahead and check that out when you open this jar right you see the product and this one it has really liquidy consistency it's really gel like and the fragrance is very 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 natural it's a little bit strong fragrance but it's not something unpleasant i really like the fragrance it's very natural and very decent and very good to smell really love that and the color of the jelly is bluish green which i really like like i really love the texture and color of this product now what is this product this is their aha power peel so now you know right that Chemical exfoliation can be done from a lot of different kind of products and there are a lot of videos out there in the market where you can really educate yourself regarding all different kind of chemical peels that are available in the market. I'm not going to take you through all of those because I haven't tried all of them. This is the one that I have tried and this is their AHA power peel. So what's an AHA peel, right? So AHA stands for alpha hydroxy acids. And why do we need AHA? So I did my little bit of research and I realized that AHA is very, very good for exfoliation. If you want to regenerate your skin, if you want to get rid of serpent scars on your face and you want to uh, tighten up your pores. I think it's something that really helps you to regain the overall health of your skin. It's going to deal with your um, scars, it's going to deal with your bigger pores, it's going to deal with the fact that it is going to exfoliate your skin. So so any dullness that comes over your skin because of the uh, dead cells that get accumulated, all these things are going to get resolved by using these peels. This cannot be done by using physical exfoliation because though those are superficial, you're using it 
on top of your skin it's not going to and it is a physical product so it is going to take its time and it is it is not going to really hit the root cause of the problem but this one will and that is why this product is called like an instant facial because it does exfoliate and detoxes your skin very well and then the layer of the skin that you get after you do your peel is fresh it's glowing and you just feel like you have gotten a facial which is very 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 impressive now when you see this box this is very informative usually i don't really go ahead and look at the box about every single detail but this one i wanted to because as you know that i was really scared before trying chemical peels so i did my little bit of homework and if you see this box everything is clearly mentioned like the direction of usage the warnings that they have mentioned and the ingredient list and they say that this is 97% of the total ingredients are of natural origin so they say that aha acid that they have in their product is extracted from fruits it's fruit ka derivatives and it is something very very natural which is a great thing in my opinion Now what does it claim it claims that your skin is going to be brightened it's going to be detoxed energized smooth and glowing so this was about the claims of this product and now i want to take you through the texture of the product and the results that i faced after i used this particular product so once you open this jar you can take the product out and this is how the texture is if i apply it on my hand right away you can see it is It is very transparent once you apply it and it's very very easy to blend over your skin. Now how I used it, I applied a thin layer of this product all over my face and I left it for around 7 minutes. It says 10 minutes, but I left it for 7 minutes because on the first day of my usage because I was a bit scared and that's why I left it for 7 minutes and after that I washed my face with cold water. Okay, that's how I used this product. After I washed my face, there was little bit of redness all over my face and i got a little bit scared but thankfully they have been really really kind to <laughs> mention these details on the uh, box so that when i went went back and i checked the box and i read it that it said clearly that little bit of redness is very common and after i read that i became a little calmer because it clearly mentioned that little bit of redness is very common in most of the cases it indicates the increased level of microcirculation microcirculation is nothing but the very high like the blood circulation all over your face now you know that when you go for facials all the massage that we do is to increase your blood circulation if your blood circulation is good you're going to get that internal glow so once i read that i was calm it took around 45 to 50 minutes for my redness to calm down however the burning sensation only lasted for 5 minutes but i did feel burning uh, sensation after i applied it and i was a little bit worried and that's why i wanted to highlight that that you will face that redness because my even my sister used it and she also faced the same thing however the burning is very tolerable and it lasts for 5 minutes and after that you will be good to go you just will feel a little bit of redness all over your face it will take its time for me it took an hour for my sister it took 45 minutes but it went away after that now after i washed my face trust me i saw an instant glow all over my face and everybody in my family agreed to it i was shocked honestly i was really shocked because i always thought that chemical peels कुछ यूजेज तो लगेंगे लाइक एक दो यूजेज के बाद आई एम नॉट गोना सी रिजल्ट बट दिस वन गेव मी एन इंस्टेंट फेशियल एंड इट इज ट्रू वट दे आर क्लेमिंग इज एब्सोल्यूटली ट्रू वेन आई वॉश माई फेस आई फेल्ट माई स्किन इज फीलिंग टाइटर देर वॉज एन इंस्टेंट ग्लो ऑल ओवर माई फेस माई फेस वॉज लाइक आई वॉज फीलिंग माई फेस इज सुपर स्क्वीकी क्लीन इट वॉज it was unbelievable the results were really unbelievable i was shocked to see it and i was so happy that i gave this product a try it has really changed the skincare game for me now that i have told you that i've liked the product i have seen the results in terms of chemical exfoliation there is an equally important segment that i want to do and that is the do's and don'ts of using chemical exfoliation so first let's talk about do's of doing this product do's may i always tell that any anyway any skincare product that you are using you should do a patch test first of all but chemical peels though you cannot skip that at all because chemicals 
peel is a step up it is an intense skin treatment and you don't want to risk your face ka skin directly and you have to have to do a patch test before you go ahead with the usage of this product so what i did i did a patch test on my palm i left it for 15 minutes and then i washed it and then i did a patch test on my neck before applying it all over my face and i waited for 15 minutes again and i washed it and only when i realized that i do not have any allergy and i'm not facing any problem and the burning sensation is tolerable i went ahead and i applied it all over my face so again highlighting that before using any chemical peel you have to have to do a patch test the second thing that you have to keep in mind is that they have also highlighted this sunburn and the sun exposure right so chemical peels lagane ke baad please please do not step out in sun directly that's why i will recommend to use this only at night i tried it only i tried it at night because sun exposure mujhe nahi chahiye tha because this product has aha and aha can really increase the sensitivity towards uh, sun okay so you have to be very careful about sun exposure apply it at night and i applied a sunscreen after that main na sunscreen ko leke bahut regular nahi hu but after i applied this aha peel right i use sunscreen um for like throughout the week because i was a bit scared so please make sure that you don't apply it in the daytime and don't so i wala jaati hu please don't take the dos that i have mentioned lightly because you have to take care of those two points like ye do point agar aapke dimag mein hai to you are good to go don't yeah yeah that do not ignore the dos that i have suggested so yeah that's what that was my experience with this product i have loved the results honestly like i have nothing to hide here i I'm so happy that I gave it a try and I'm so happy with the product that I got my hands on to because mujhe isse results first use ke baad dikha hai maine bahut I have seen a lot of videos on chemical peels and I have seen people saying that this shows results after a month and uh, things like that but this one showed me results immediately so I'm very happy on the selection of the product also I think and now last but not the least I would like to thank Opa Reviews and Amino for sending out these products to me I am so lucky that they did select me for this product and I got my hands on to this and I was able to try something so amazing in my skincare routine and with this we have come to the end of this video I hope you like this one if you did please do not forget to hit that like button and share my channel subscribe to it i will be up soon in my next video till the time take care bye bye be beautiful and stay very happy bye namaste